Good morning. Just saying hi first thing in the day, just to, you know, do like a kind of ritual thing and show you when I got up. Um, I woke up and I was lying in bed thinking about my dreams and then there was a doorbell at 8.30 and I went upstairs to see who it was and I saw a package on the table, so I guess my dad got it and brought it in. Just for my mom, from like a running group or a race or something, some Lara bars. And, um... And then I came back downstairs, and Charlotte called, and I'm like, I guess I better video call with her, and then I got dressed in my running clothes while I was talking to her, and I opened the windows, just because I figured, you know what, I might as well get moving. I wanted to lie down and sleep some more, but <sighs> just got to keep powering through the day. So I'm checking my emails now, the stock market's tanking, maybe I'll just go for a jog, it's already 10.30 now, maybe I'll go for a jog though to get some fresh air, and then, then buckle down, what are you doing? I never showed you guys my Purim costume. I made a couple of digital photos for my temple, and then I also submitted them to this Jewish group. Uh, so there's me as Jeff Bezos. I used my Instagram green screen for that, and a little Jeff Bezos name tag, because he owns Amazon, and I look like him. And then uh, here's me as Dr. Evil uh, there, and it says Arch Nemesis of Austin Powers, just for people who don't know. Yes, it is. All right, let's see. Where's me? It's very, very cruel. You just want to go okay, to all right. Wait, get to my part. Where's my part? I thought it was, like, right here. Uh, this is what Jews post. Don't you guys wish, like, you were Jewish instead of, like, Christmas stuff? Okay, wait. Okay, that's not me. Oh, but there's me. Look at that. Um, here, let me make it brighter. Yeah, okay. That's not me. Not me. Not me. Still not me. <clears throat> oh, there's my sister. Look at that. And there's me. I feel like I'm going to appear here. Come on. We can do this. We don't have a lot of... Okay, there's my sister and her husband. And then... Oh, there's me as Jeff Bezos. This is... And then there's me as Dr. Evil. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Yeah. And that's where I had my bar mitzvah over there. All right, my loves. I just want to say good night. Uh, what did I do today? Uh, I checked it in the morning with you. And then I've just been basically plowing through emails. Uh, remember I was up to like 700, I'm down to like 555 now or something. Just trying to actually address each one and go, okay, is this useful? Is this something I need to do? Do I need to reply to it? Uh, it feels good. And, uh, yeah, and then I had to run to the bank. I was trying to film a video outside, but it kept saying, will not load video or something. So I don't know what was going on. Uh, but I made it to the bank on time, around four, and then I just jogged back. I was like, hmm. I felt like, you know, I felt like I would just love to just run around town and stuff, but I thought, no, that's not going to advance things. I need to get back, I need to get back on the computer and uh, and start working on things. And while I was going through the emails, like, I came back, and I ran back downstairs, and I was listening, actually, well, on my walk, I was also listening to the a podcast convention, um, giving lots of advice on the history of podcasting, which was interesting, and a couple of people messaged after their talks, and I said, maybe you can help me teach some classes on Instagram, so that was fun. And then, yeah, my dad texted the dinner was on, I guess. No, I think I went up to have a shower, finally. And then on the way back down, dinner was happening. And my, my mom's like, oh, you had a shower and you're dressed? She's like, if I have a shower after 6 p.m., I don't get dressed again. And I'm like, yeah, well, it was like 6.02. But also, what does my dress consist of? It's basically my pajamas, sweatpants, and long johns, and a hoodie. So... Uh, and then, uh, yeah, she made some nice noodles, or she had a package of noodles. My dad was supposed to buy some noodles a long time ago, and he bought some weird keto noodles, and my mom said, off. Oh, I'll try using these up, so it was good. She made a shrimp thing. And then, uh, what was I going to say? Well, one thing, there's a new thing. My mom's like, here, you don't want to send a postcard? Because the, the government has mailed out, is this them here? Yeah, has mailed out these free postcards saying, you know, send them to someone you care about. Uh, a short note can go a long way. So they're actually promoting mail. So uh, my mom wrote down my niece's address, and I'm going to draw it. And then she kept saying, like, you know, you can go draw it and go mail it while you're out. And I'm like, yeah. Um, <clears throat> but I didn't. I haven't drawn it yet. But it's important not to say, you know, it's, take two seconds. It's better to send it than to, to always wonder. Because I have all these free, um, like, envelopes with stamps on them and... and um, I bought some for long distance, like over the ocean mailing, because I'm going to mail them to this girl when I was 17. She lived in uh, Israel, and I just never sent them, and I still got them. 
you gotta send things while people are still around to get your mail. Oh, and I can't remember how this happened, but I was looking into, like, I've been looking into getting my dad a Google Chromecast or something for his TV so he can watch movies. But then it occurred to me, I wonder what's in the Apple ecosystem. And I started Googling that, and I was like, oh, there's Apple TV. I never really thought about that. And then I was looking up to see if there's a different thermostat for Apple, and uh, there's something at Ecobee. So I posted on Facebook a couple of questions about these things, and lots of people gave me really good advice, actually. So I'm like, huh, i got to use Facebook more often. I'm always like, got to craft the perfect thing, got to be very... But no, some people just boost whatever. Hi, everybody, what I mean? For like, just treat it like a brain dump. You never know what kind of advice you'll get from people. So thank you to everybody for that. And, uh, yeah, my sister messaged me tonight. She said, uh, well, first my niece messaged me a little drawing, and it said, guess what she drew? And I'm like, it looks like your mom's sitting at a computer. That was cool. And I'm like, oh, I wish she was still young again. I've missed a decade. I've missed her growing up. What have I done? Anyways, my sister, my other sister says she might come by tomorrow or go to Costco with my dad. And Oh, and I was all set to go to bed around 9.30 or something, but I'm like, maybe I'll go upstairs and have just a little bowl of puffed wheat. Uh, and then I had that, and bread with jam, and almonds, and lots of cheese, and ugh, that's exactly what I did last night, and then I had this bad taste in my mouth. Anyway, I gotta, gotta get my act together. But I was also watching this video, who was it? I guess one, one of the people in the conference today was saying that, you know, if you can get up really early, it takes you, you know, if you get up really early one day, you'll realize how much more you get done and you'll do it every day it'll be worth it but you also have to start planning that the night before you have to go to bed on time otherwise you're tired and this is a sort of youngish woman and i'm like okay so if even she's tired when she doesn't have enough sleep what excuse do i have so definitely i gotta go to bed now uh, and i'll listen to a podcast in the darkness and hopefully fall asleep and i hope you're going to sleep too good night